Yo, what's going on guys? So today I went on Instagram. I was like, yo, about to hit this Q&A. So I got Crystal over there and she gonna pick all the questions and I'm gonna answer. And if any of them pertain to you, then you gotta answer too. Okay. So just because you guys really liked it last time, another ice cream. We came to this tradition now. Okay. What is your biggest fear? Probably, uh... <laughs> Damn! Mountain lions. Uh, I am scared of mountain lions, but I don't know. I don't think that's my biggest fear. Maybe drowning or something. I don't know. I hate those questions. Did you ever think you'd be a YouTuber and get hell holes? Uh, yeah. When I started YouTube, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not yet at the holes. But no, when I started YouTube, like me and Travis, we were like, yeah, we gonna be YouTubers, and uh, so we had a, we had a goal in mind, and we set out and we did the thing. So, and about the hose, everybody got hose. Compton asked Crystal and Charles, "What is your biggest accomplishment?" Like together? No, like just you, and then I guess just me. My biggest accomplishment? Wow! Wow! What's yours? Probably graduating from college with an AA. But then go to a UC. Hitting the honey K. <laughs> Anyways, have you ever competed in boxing or are you ever going to compete? Right now I'm too heavy, but I have before, yeah, when I was younger. What's the weirdest date you've ever been on? I don't know if there's really a date, but there's one girl. Okay, I'm going to tell you something. I'm not going to give you all a timeline, but you can say it was recent. But, okay, so I went to... <laughs> Did your hoop just fall out? Hold it. The bigger the hoop, the bigger the hole. Dang. That shit was, no. That means my ear can't hold it because I'm not a hoe. True. True. <laughs> Yo, that's not working. That's not going for you. Okay, so there's this one girl. She had, okay, so so I didn't even get her number anything. Met her straight off Snapchat. But she had a really big fucking head. Like, I'm not going to lie. Like, she came out. She was about a solid 5'8". Like, I was sitting outside. I was like, who is this gargantuan walking towards my car and she came in like some yoga pants a sweatshirt and some running shoes so she got in the car and i was like cool we gonna run in like we gonna exercise right now like what's good and she was like no she was just like of course like no haha you're funny whatever but i was just sitting there the whole time like i gotta go home so i went and got subway because i was hungry and then i just like after subway i didn't want to feel rude so i kind of like talked to her for a little bit but then i was just like no i gotta go and after that i never talked to her again but she had a big head um, dog ate half of one of her shoes. I was just like, <laughs> I was like, oh, you got some Nike free run. She was like, nah, these some Skechers. I was like, I was like, oh, that's tight. That's hard. And like Skechers. And then I was like, you don't got no other shoes? She's like, nah, these are just comfortable. I was like, oh, yeah, I bet. I hung out with Cortex. Would you rather live for a thousand years or 10 lives for a hundred years each? Cool meeting you at LA Fit, bro. <laughs> LA Fit Expo or LA Fitness? LA Fitness Expo. His name is Mario. Mario. Uh, what? Ten, wait, ten lives for... Okay, you're either going to live for a thousand years. Yeah. Or ten lives for a hundred years each. So you can die ten times in your life. Yeah. That's kind of annoying, dying. No, like, we'll live to be a hundred and then we die. And then we get reborn again. Live another hundred years. So a thousand yeah. years either way. Yes. <laughs> but you're either going to die or just live a complete thousand years. Oh, I'd go the complete thousand. <laughs> I don't care, but no, I'm trying to do a thousand years straight because I feel like 600 years into it, I'm going to be a knowledgeable motherfucker that's lonely. Who's funnier, Crystal or Charles? Me. There you go. I'm not funny. Crystal, when will you make your YouTube channel? And Charles, where do you see yourself in the next five years? Five years, I want to see, I want to see this hit a million. I actually want my vlog channel to hit a million for show. So let me shamelessly promote my vlog channel. Hey, you ain't subscribe to that shit. Oh wait, this is all my vlog channel. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, I want to see. I want to see both channels hit a million, and I also like want to start doing like more acting stuff, and like doing like additions and stuff steps towards that. So, what about you and you? I plan on starting my YouTube when I get a camera. It's as simple as that. Okay. How was it your first time getting high? Was it with Travis? Was good. It was good. No, I, who said that? Angel Herrera. Oh. 
My first time getting high. I only got high because I was sitting on the couch one time and my parents slipped. And my mom told my dad something like, you used to smoke weed. And like, I'd always like contemplate smoking weed. So I sat there and went, you smoke? And I was listening and then uh, <clears throat> I asked my mom and she was like, I did when I was younger. So then I immediately text my homie like, hey bro, we're getting faded. Cause, and then I just went over there, picked up uh, some weed, like a dime or something. And I parachuted the shit out of it. Right, Apple. I don't understand any of this lingo. You've never gotten high? Yeah, but what the fuck? Do you have any goals for the last couple of months in 2016? I'm dropping another 30 pounds. No, no you're, you're gonna look too skinny. You're, you're gonna, gonna find, find a way. I'm dropping another 30 pounds. Look. Suck it. I can't. Put it in your mouth. That's too big. <laughs> If you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? I'd probably change my teeth so they weren't so west side. <laughs> <laughs>I forgot that threw me off. What's one thing you honestly don't like about Crystal and what's one thing she doesn't like about you? Oh, this is gonna get real. Who said this? <laughs> Fly guy Lido. He said a little different, but question for both. Okay, what don't I like about Crystal? <laughs> We're about to find out the two guys. I got something from this past week and I don't like about Crystal. I'll just play. You probably do. Are you serious right now? <laughs> What I don't like about Crystal is, uh, I feel like you take forever. Wow, me too. That's what I don't like about you. Really? How do we both take forever? That doesn't work. Okay, I only, I've taken forever these times. She'll take 20 minutes to take a picture. I'm like, bro, you know this shit closed at two. <laughs> what are you doing? He always says he's on his way and he's not really on his way. Or he's like, oh, okay, I'm about to shower real quick and then I'll be on my way. And it's like 12 p.m. and then all, it's like I'm getting the text at 3.30. Okay, I'm on my way. It takes you three and a half hours to fucking shower. I'm understandable. I'm a girl and I have a fuck ton of hair. Get a weave. Is that Rob? What do you look for in a female? I got this, this, this corny ass. Okay. What do I look for in a girl? You guys really want to know? Okay. I can't fuck with bad personality because I can't fuck with toxicity. Okay, guys, this is what I look for in a girl. I want a girl who makes me want to be better and to, uh, <laughs> to just keep you on track in life. You know, just like, I want to be better for this person. And it is. He just went a walk from member on it. <laughs> Did I? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, he says that at the end. He's like. What did you say? At the end. With a dad? Mm -hmm. He's like. Say? Shut the fuck up! What do I do? Another thing I don't like about Charles. <laughs> what I do? What's the most embarrassing I'll moment fuck, of your life? Down. <laughs> it happened two weeks ago. <laughs> it happened actually a week ago. About a week ago. Me and Travis know we'll forever take this story to the grave. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell y'all. <laughs> it wasn't horror. It, it's just like... Let me just say it sounds like a movie. Like straight out of The Hangover. Okay, that's all that happened. Interesting. It's very interesting, actually. It's actually bizarre. Would you ever date a girl taller than you? I'm already kind of tall, so if she's taller than me, I'm gonna have to climb her bitch ass. What would you want your tombstone to say? My most memorable phrase or quote that has not yet been said. Okay, so what is it? Out there, y'all. No, no, no. Out Shout there, y'all. This is where all the dead bitches are. <laughs> but right here, I'm six feet under, man. <laughs> what does say something like that? Here lies a uh, uh, husband, a uh, father. Uh. That's a weird question. I think I'd put on it like, I bet y'all enjoying life. I'll pay. Stop standing here. <laughs> <laughs> if you had a small loan of a million dollars. Small loan. For a day only, what would you do with it? It's a loan. I gotta pay it back. <laughs> I wouldn't do shit with it. <laughs> I would not spend a dime. Wow, did you guys see how excited I was? Because I was already thinking of what I would do with it's it until though. you said that. I don't want to pay back loans. <laughs> True, you're right. Fuck that. Scariest thing that has happened to you? Scariest? I don't know. 
Those are always like really random questions. What was the what about you? Probably my car accident where like I literally flatlined for like a solid 30 seconds. You died? I died. You did not Ask my what? mom. I swear to you died. Yeah, in 2012. What the fuck? Mm -hmm. I never knew you died. Yeah. I knew you. You did. And you fucking died. I died for 30 seconds. Where? Here. In the car accident. No, it was like like right after you pass Nod's Berry Farm, like when you're coming back from that way. I was like in the fast lane and a car I'm assuming he didn't see me. I was probably in his blind spot. <laughs> he like came and like he hit the front of my car that was my hoop again. <laughs> and like This is why you're fucking possessed. Hold on. He hit your car. What? Okay, so I was going like 75, 80 miles an hour. Did you see anything? Did you hear voices? Did you see light? What happened? I could hear things, but that's it. Like Did you see your life? Like did you see God? Like people be talking about near death experiences, like what, what happened? Yeah, I know, but I mean like you to be honest. Yeah. Okay, so the car hit you. The car hit me the and then one. I like hit the like you know like the white thing the intercept what is it the intermediate yeah, 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 yeah. I hit that and then right. flipped into the freeway and to the other side yeah four times and the car hit you uh -huh. and then I was like on the other side and like it was weird I want to say he was like a guardian angel because I shit you not the person that brought me back to life had just gotten off of work and he was like a respiratory therapist. So he knew how to like bring me back. And he left the scene because he's like, in case I broke any of your ribs, like I could get sued. So he left the scene. But he didn't break any of my ribs. Like I had like nothing on me. It was crazy. This shit just blew my mind. I know. You did know me then too. You never said any. You, no, you just never said. I'm sorry I interrupted half of the son of this story, <laughs> but god damn, that was crazy. That's the scariest thing that's ever happened to me, guys. <laughs> I died. You fucking died. What the fuck? And I really loved that car too, and it was completely total. What'd you have? Huh? I had a Nissan Altima. Hold up. A beautiful white. You car. died. I died. You fucking died. I fucking died. Were you fucked up? I just had bruises everywhere, like how I ran. I had like a bruise right here. From the I remember like yeah, and I hit like my head on the. I think that that's why. I died because I was flatlined because he said I didn't have like a heart rate or anything was because of the way that I hit my head like on the steering wheel because you know how I'm short as fuck I sit really close yeah and then like I bounced up and all that stuff because I mean when you're flipping <laughs> that, that is legit the the craziest thing I've heard this week <laughs> you fucking went over that thing and flipped and hit traffic did your car get air no you want to know what's crazy is like except for the car that hit me all the other cars stopped so they just saw like, you fucking you coming that, fucking like, over the God field. God was on my side. Like, so, uh, he knew that I was going to do something with my life because he let me live. Like, I believe in all that stuff. Like, when it's your time, it's your time. But apparently it wasn't my time back then. Wow. I know. You learn something new about me every day. That time. was fucking cr Can I send a video right there? Like, that? <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Oh, yeah, I ain't had no shit like that, man. I, <laughs> <laughs> she died, y'all. How the fuck? <laughs> Yo, that's tripping me out. I almost drowned in the ocean one time, but I didn't die like her. Drowning scares you, though. But I didn't die. <laughs> like, I didn't have to get saved. I just came outside with my butt cheeks on. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that. Crystal sucks a mean ice cream. Um, As always... Appreciate you guys watching. Thank you so much. Thank you, Crystal, for picking out the questions. No problem. If she didn't answer it, this is why I have her read them because she takes all the heat of what <laughs> questions she picked. She didn't pick my... That's her fault, not mine. <laughs>